okay, what we're going to do to correct this, this problem here with the L joining in with part of the frame is that we're going to click on the node here and we're going to click, hold down the shift key and click on this node and then we're going to go up to the split path between two endpoints icon and click on that and now it has split the path. We're going to do the same thing over here. We're going to click on this node and we're going to click on this node and we're going to click on split path and there you have now two uh, four endpoints that are no longer connected. Now we're going to connect the L here by clicking on this node, holding down the shift key, click on this node, and now you're going to join selected in nodes with a segment. And you're going to do this up here. You're going to click on this node, hold down the shift key, click on this node, and join with the segment. Now what happens here is it's got this the handles all are skewed, so you want to correct that. But, but you also want to correct that you don't want it to be curved. So keeping these both selected, you can now go up to your Make Selected Segment Lines. Make these into a, a straight line, basically. And click that, and now it's a straight line. So all you have to do now is get this up to the other side of, of the L, the same level. And I just eyeball it. <clears throat> All right. You want to make sure that it's this line is straight and that you're 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 fine. All right. So now we've solved that problem. So let's go new. Let's go uh, zoom out by clicking clicking the minus key again. Zoom out. Let's select our detail, and we can bring it over and set it on top. And let's go into View, Display, Normal. All right. So it did correct that area. There's a few issues that we need to correct, but basically this gives you an idea of how what kind of issues you might run into when you're creating a match and how to fix them. This concludes our tutorial on how to make a better cut. The next tutorial will be how to save our files into the various formats. I hope you enjoyed this and I wish you much success.